Hey, what is up guys and welcome to some more Romori. So last time we went to the lost forest and we saw some stuff. All right? We saw like like cats, spider cats, uh we saw uh, daddy long legs, we saw basil, we saw some shit, all right? But now we just got to we just got to rebuild this uh this railroad track and see what's on the other side of this of this fence. You want to set down wooden track here? Sure. Let's go, Omori! And just look at my boy Omori go, man. Hey, what's going on, Mary? How you doing? <laughs> okay. Alright, let's see what's... Oh, it's a, it's a bridge! Yo, is that a... Is, is that a castle? I, hey, that, that's actually pretty dope! Okay, so we go into the castle? Is, is that what... Is that what's happening here? Basil, are you here? Hey, look, it's Mary. Yeah, Mary, what's going on? Mary, Mary. Oh, hello, everyone. You all made it through the forest. I'm so proud of you. Mary, I... I, I was so scared. Ah, look at him, bro. It's all right, hero. Oh, hero. You're going to have to deal with this eventually. These things will only get worse over time. Alright, let's go see this castle then. Oh, what the hell is this? Sproutmo? Oh! Uh... Sproutmo. All alrighty. Alrighty then. Oh, they're all... They're all dead. Oh, it's a ladder. Hey, hold on for a second, bro. Sprout Mall Village. Dun, 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 dun. Hey, what's going on, Mary? Oh, this place looks pretty cool, man. What's this? Sweet. Oh, it's this. This is the the place for the play. Wait a second. I know this show. We have front row show tickets for it. Ah, I can see it now. A dazzling epic tale about the hardships of romance, heartbreak, betrayal. Desperation, loneliness, oh the drama. Oh, she seems pretty excited about it. I don't know. I guess it looks interesting. But now doesn't seem like the right time. But you promised we could earlier. Please, hero. We should at least check it out. Please, 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 please. All right, Aubrey, calm down. Well, all right. Hopefully this won't take too long. Please enjoy your front row seats, fellow normal-looking Sproutmos. Alrighty. Uh, thank you, sir. This is the place. Wow, look at this huge stage. It's just as amazing as I imagined. Let's take our seats. It looks like the show is about to start. Okay. Okay, seems like a show was about to start. Alright. Shh, shh. Sprout more mic. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to a special episode of Sweetheart's Quest for Hearts. Hey, woo, yeah, woo, yeah, woo, yeah. But before our show, we want to take a moment to honor the life of someone who has been an inspiration to us all. Our beloved leader. Ye old Sprout? That sounds familiar. Oh shit! He was truly a father that none of us deserved. <laughs> Let us have a moment of silence in memory of him. Oh shit, my bad, man. Hey, bro. Hey, bro. <laughs> May he rest in peace. Um, uh, uh, um, okay. And now, one to the show. Drum roll, please. Last time on Sweetheart's Quest for Hearts, our favorite princess once again failed to fall in love with any of her eligible bachelors. But this time, we rounded up three new very attractive contestants. Will one of them be able to capture Sweetheart's heart? 
Let's reveal them now. Okay. Contestant number one is a local of Strathmore Village. Give it up for contestant number one. Whoa, yeah. Yeah. You go, contestant number one. Contestant number two is, yep, you guessed it. Also a local Sprottmore village. Give it up for contestant number two. Whoa, let's go. Let's go. Contestant number two. Contestant number three comes all the way from other world. It's like he just fell out of the sky. Literally. According to him and us, that makes him a catch. Give it up for Snaily. Oh yeah. Snaily. Let's go, Snaily. You got this brother. And now. It's the moment you've all been waiting for! Dim the lights, please! Okay, okay, I'm excited! She emits beauty! She exudes grace! She truly has the most pocritudinous face! Yes! You know who we're talking about! She's all that is amazing and wonderful, and she is just about to set foot on this very stage. Please, give a big warm welcome to... The one, the only, the magnificent... Sweetheart! Who's this dude? Mustache Mall. Someone, please help me. I am in need of a handsome young gentleman. Oh well, you know, I'm right here if you want me, if you need me. <laughs> you, yes. You there, in the striped pants. You magnificent beast. Yes, you look like you'll do just fine. Please, kind sir. Will you help out a poor lowly mole? I am desperately in need of your service. Well, since you asked so nicely, how can I refuse? Thank you, thank you, young lad! You're too generous. Please, come this way now. Chop chop! Wait, wait, hold on, can my friends come too? Ah, uh, yes, your friends! You're all here to see Sweet Tart's quest, yes? If so, you will all meet again soon enough. Now come, sir, we must make haste. Time is of the essence. Alrighty, let the show begin! Greetings, sweetheart fans. We apologize for the short intermission. Please give a warm welcome to our new contestant number three! Hailing all the way from the vast forest, it's our hero in shining armor. Whoa, yeah, wait. Hero? It's hero! It's hero! Hey, what's, what's going on, hero? <laughs> <laughs> and get this guys, Hero's a real hunk, standing on a whopping 5 foot 7. His passions include baking, cooking and cleaning. And if that doesn't sound like the perfect man, check out his killer smile and mild personality. Okay, <laughs> and now once again, it's time to introduce the star of the show. Dim the lights please. She's the one, the only. The Magnificent! <laughs> what? Huh? Sweet talk. Oh, that's a uh, Space Boyfriend Sex! An excellent entrance, my liege! Whoa, Sweet Talk! Yeah, whoa, let's get it! Ah, uh, yes! It is me! Hello, my stupid adoring fans! We love you, Sweet Talk! Yeah, you're the best stupid adoring fans! <laughs> Sweetheart, we have brought three of the best bachelors in the world onto this very stage. Let's start with some questions. Do you, contestant number one, agree to pledge your allegiance to Sweetheart for the rest of your life? Contestant number one, what is your answer? Uh, sure. I don't know. I guess. Um, just three feet tall? My, that is much too short. Send them off to the dungeon. Hey, hey, what? What did you say? The, the dungeon. 
Whoa, 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 what the fuck? What? <laughs> what the hell's that? Hey, man. Hey, no, bro. Uh, help me. Now on to contestant number two. My word. This one. His very being offends me. Take him away, boys. Contestant number three. It looks like you're the last one standing. I'll ask the same question one more time. Again, no pressure at all. Do you, hero, agree to pledge your allegiance to Sweetheart for the rest of your life? Well, no. That doesn't seem fair at all. Why would I do that? My, this one, he's absolutely immaculate. Could it be? Is Sweetheart in love? Wait, wait, but I just said- Ah, yes, yes, you'll do just fine. Uh, why do I have to do this? Um, I'm sorry, sweetheart, but I'm not interested. Why, whatever do you mean, my prince? I, uh... This is all really flattering and all, but you know, we only just met like a few moments ago, and, well, I have to reject your, um, offer? <laughs> oh, pish posh. Oh, don't be silly, hero. I've never heard anything sillier. It's... it's true. I'm sorry, sweetheart, but... I... don't... want... to marry you. Hey, baby, baby. hold on, bro, hold on, bro, hold on, hold on, bro, hold on, what's happening right here? This... This is preposterous. No, this, this is blasphemy. You dare reject Sweetheart? Everyone loves Sweetheart, you hear me? Everyone. Send him off to the dungeon. Hey, stop right there. You can't take Hero, he belongs to us. Ah, I see. You must be Hero's fans. Fans? Does she not know what friends are? <laughs> Guards? Take them away! Holy moly, what? <laughs> now you've done it, Aubrey! Oh shit, what the fuck?